Hello and welcome to Beyond the Lens. A few years ago, I did a tutorial on how to clean up your sound in Adobe Audition. Now, this was in CS 5.5 and we've had a few versions since then. I think this was, what, three years ago, perhaps I did this? I'm can't, I, can, I can't remember myself. Um, anyway, I've had a few comments saying this is out of date. You know, could I do another one with CS, with CC for 2014? So here we go. Now, a lot of the processes, you can use it exactly the same way, but as your understanding of sound and techniques changes, you change with the times. So I do things slightly differently, so I'm going to show you how I do them. So I've got Audition open here. If you're working in Premiere and you want to export your audio into Audition, all you have to do is right-click on the audio in your timeline and select edit in Adobe Audition and it'll bring you to this. But it'll have a sound wave in, but we don't have one here so I'm going to record one. So let's hit record. Here we go, I'm going to record something here. Um, you can see that it's the sound wave is coming up and now I'm going to leave some dead space. There we go. Now the reason why I left a little bit of dead space is because I want to be able to get a bit of sound, um, get a sound print so that I can know what I'm taking out. Um, always good to do that when you're recording. So we're going to select a little bit of an area there, our dead space, and we're going to go to effects. We're going to go to Noise Reduction, Capture Noise Print. Now, back up to Effects. Back to our Noise and Restoration, Ooh, missed it there, and Noise Reduction Process. Now, I'm going to set this to default. This is how it will look when you first do it. Now, what I'm going to do first off, the Spectral Decay Rate Change that down to 15. Otherwise, it can make you sound like you're in a bit of a tin can. These should be okay, especially for this microphone, but you want to play about with it. You've got your noise reduction of sometimes, you know, depending on what it is, 50%, 60%, and how much you reduce by. The other thing I do, this blue line here, this is your frequency line. If we change this so it basically almost matches the yellow line here on your frequencies. It helps. It helps a lot. So we're going to apply that. Oh, we're going to <laughs> First of all, we've got to select the entire file. I nearly mucked up there. And then click Apply. Straight away, you'll see the noise front and back has gone down. But this has gone, this has got smaller. Anyway, what we're going to do now is slightly different. We're going to go to Effect. Filter an EQ, and we're going to go to Parametric Equalizer. And what I'm doing, I'm selecting Loudness Maximizer. We've hit Apply there. You notice it lifts up slightly. Now we're going to normalize it, which normalizes out the frequencies and makes it sound better. So, effect. Amplitude and compression, dynamic, right in there it is, <laughs> normalize process. Now, here I'm normalizing it to 95.8, which is usually what you have with radio stations. So we'll apply that. Straight away you'll see everything's got bigger. Now we're going to put in a noise gate, which cuts out dead space noise. So again, effects, amplitude and compression, Dynamic Processing, and in your presets, go down to Compander, good old Compander, and spline the curve so it's nice. Don't forget, when you're doing this, I, I know what this, how this mic works and everything, so I know what sound I can get with it. If you find it's clipping, you can adjust this, this one here, up and down, to get it right. So we're going to apply that. Notice it goes back down again. Now, we normalize again. One more time just to get things back 
to I think back to again 95.8 on mid 90s and there we go so that is our sound here we go I'm going to record something here um, you can see that it's the sound wave is coming up and now I'm going to leave some dead space I hope this was helpful and I will talk to you guys soon or catch you guys soon, see you guys soon for another thrilling tutorial. Have a great time guys. Bye bye.